Hello, hello, Built in Hollows Corner, 101. Wednesday afternoon, just gonna run out and grab some uh, some Wendy's for the family. Start my uh, my new job tomorrow. For all of you that, have, oops, hold on. <laughs> hello again. For all of you that have been following me, uh, I do. I I got a new job at a place. I'm gonna be. I'm actually gonna be starting up um, a whole other area of it. And it's mine. It's all mine. I'm the I'm the, I'm the manager and uh, head dude <laughs> in this area. And I'll be bouncing back and forth for a while until I can build up a business down here. But uh, but this is my area, so can't beat that. Uh, I'm gonna keep what I'm making an hour to myself. Um, the people who know me know what it is an hour. Um, I will say that it's a lot of money. <laughs> uh, you know, it, it's a lot of money for me. In my head, because you know, I, I either if I'm not making commission, people don't want to pay you by the hour. But this is actually hourly, and it is a lot more than I was originally going to ask for. I actually started off with this number, figuring, okay, we'll work down. Since he started off with a ridiculous number, he actually wanted to pay me twelve dollars an hour. And I don't know if I made a video of that or not. I think I did, but I'm not too sure. And I was like, nah, that's not gonna happen. Uh, but lo and behold. Um, it, I, let's put it this way: I'm gonna be, I'm, I, I'm, I'm gonna be very comfortable, and which is all I want. You know, I know I'm not gonna be rich, but I will be very, very comfortable. My bills will be paid. Uh, my bills will probably be able to be paid with one week's check. Let's say it that way, and I'll leave it alone. I don't want it. That guy almost came right into me. He's going right at me. So I'm very happy. I, I think it's so well deserved. I honestly do. I'm good enough for it. And I think it's a long time coming, and um, that's it with that. But for all of you that have been following and keeping up with what's been going on with me, you all know that it's been a real struggle for the past three months. It's scary what little you can learn to live on. Um, scary what little you can learn to live on. But I told my wife, I said, if, if I've learned one thing from this experience, I've learned not to be frivolous with my money anymore. Um, but if we can live off of what we have been, then you know what? Then we can save a lot of money. Because I, when I have money in my pocket, listen, I'm the first person to admit it. It burns a hole in my pocket. I gotta buy something. I am a consumer through and through. It just, it, I just am. I like to shop. I like to buy things for my kid. Um, and I end up broke at the end of the day. Like, let's put it this way: what I buy for my son all year long, just it's not big stuff. That's a really nice Mustang. Hold on. Really nice Mustang. Wow! What I buy for my son all year long, if I just bought it and put it away, he could have a Christmas for three kids. And then, of course, at Christmas we have to go all out and go crazy. So I'm 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 not gonna do that anymore. You know, I'll buy him little things here and there, but not like I, I usually do. And I usually do. I spoil the holy crap out of them. I'm gonna actually park. I'm gonna I'll pick this up later on. I'm not gonna go through the drive-through because I think they screw you over here at the drive-through. You know, like Joe Pesci said, they fuck you at the drive-thru. Well, you know what? They do fuck you at the drive-thru. Doesn't matter if it's McDonald's, Burger King, or whoever. They fuck you at the drive-thru. Uh, I'm not really in the lines, am I? Yeah, maybe I am. So, I'll pick this up in a bit. Just wanted to make a quick little shout-out and uh, and say that I have found something. It's it's a very, very good something. I'm extremely excited. Uh, to, I start tomorrow. He's excited. Um, I'm going to meet my contacts at the uh, commercial accounts tomorrow I'm the new um, I'm the new contact guy so he wants that done I, I, I promised him the world and I will come through but I always promise the world and I always come through but I usually get stuck at the end this time I, I uh, you make a deal on the way in people don't don't expect a raise from anybody because it's never gonna happen they'll pat you on the back when you're doing a great job and the second you ask for a raise they'll give you a million and one excuses why they can't give it to you so I'm not expecting a raise from from this man anytime soon this is enough money for sure. I'm very happy with it. And I am going to be quite content with it for a very long time. And eventually, I guess, when I get Greenville and, and uh, Simpsonville area built up, maybe we'll talk then about something else. But I don't even care. So, I'm, at 40 years old, it took me this long to realize you make your deal on the way in. Uh, not make you... You know, well, well, I'll take this much now, and you'll give me more later, right? Yeah, never gonna happen. I don't care where you are. 
So that's it for now. Bill from Harlow's Corner 101. Remember to uh, keep track of me. Um, you know, absolutely comment. Say something. Anything. Hello. Fuck you. Whatever you want to say, say something. But I uh, say, you know, tell your friends about me too. Harlow's Corner 101, right? Right? You want to subscribe, upload, share, do it all? Out.